Hi, I'm Elaine Shea. I'm the Verge Program Director, and we're here at Green Biz Studio with Mark Anthony Thomas, who is a director at the Mayor's Operations Innovation Team in the City of Los Angeles. Welcome, Mark. Thank you. So, question for you. The Mayor's Operations Innovation Team, what do you guys do in LA? So, two years ago, the mayor reached out to the business community and said, I want to create a team that actually tackles structural reform mm. um, that included procurement, uh, asset management, and workers' comp. And once money was actually raised through the Mayor's Foundation, uh, which we call the Mayor's Fund, our team was assembled and I was hired to lead that team to drive those reforms. Excellent. So, what specifically in terms of reforms were necessary? Yes, when you have a city the size of Los Angeles, problems can grow more entrenched, become more complex without anyone actually trying to tackle them yeah. specifically. Uh, and so when we look at our three reforms, these are problems that everyone agreed needed to be solved and needed dedicated resources to lead what that solution would look like. Okay, so were they transportation and what else? Well, no, it, it was our city's procurement process. Oh, the and entire how procurement process, stuff, okay. Um, how we manage all of our real estate assets. I see. Um, and the city owns a lot of property. Right. Um, we want them to be more sustainable in how we manage our buildings. Uh, we want to be better at, at optimizing the resources of them. Um, and our third big issue was we have a lot of workforce injuries and how do we actually create a, a modern wellness and safety approach for our employees. So Mark, tell me about the tech procurement process in LA. Okay, over time, government procurement has gotten slower, more complex. At the same time, innovation and the pace of new technology has really ramped up. And so they currently do not mix well. Um, what we've had to do is start looking at our entire process for all entities of the city and say, how do we actually get innovation in faster? Um, whether it's you want to prototype something or kind of big enterprise systems, how do we make sure our departments and the different parts of the city, when they actually want to buy something, have a faster access, have the right expertise, helping make sure the process works. On the vendor side, which we have over 8,900 vendors who work with the city annually, wow. how do we make sure their experience is consistent is has some certainty to it um, and that it's a pleasant experience as they actually try to do business with us. So what advice do you have then for uh, technology vendors in this case that aren't very experienced with cities and tr trying to get their services um, used within a city? Well I would say for one you definitely have to be patient. Um, I think there's definitely a national movement on fixing tech procurement right now but I feel like it's something that only really was recently like something we all wanted to push. Uh, and so for the smaller firms, because to some extent they have different issues, uh, really be able to understand kind of how to make the case that your product is something that a city should really e explore. Uh, being able to understand kind of how city government works inside, uh, building relationships, uh, uh, and making sure that it makes sense for them to actually even explore acquiring that good. Um, the larger companies really helping cities optimize the resources they spend on big enterprise software. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for that advice. Um, yeah. Hopefully, those in our audience will be able to capitalize on that. So, okay. thanks for coming. Thank you.